Hey guys, Greg here uh, again with r &W Distilling. Hey, hey listen, now that you have your body section cut, your copper of a three inch body section cut, um, you, you're going to need to uh, fasten the ferrules that you can also buy on our website, rnwdistilling.com. Now, now these are, um, these ferrules are brass, 99.8% lead free for any of you guys out there that are, that are skeptical. Um, so, you know, you, you don't have to worry about any, anything leaching into into your product. 99.8% um, lead free is about as pure as you can get. So um, anyway, to, to fasten these sections on here, and like I was saying about that chop saw and making a square cut on on these uh, on these pipes, as as they said, if you look inside these uh, these ferrules, there's a shoulder cut that, that, that the CNC machine has cut out of there, and this actually fits right on top of there. And if you look inside there, you you want that to seat on there properly because you want this this pipe. Um, or this body section to be square so when you when you start to build your tower up you want these squares because if you don't it, it's going to start either leaning to one side or leaning to the other side it's going to be very difficult to, uh, to, to to get these to set on there properly so anyway um, as you can see this thing fits on there very very well so uh, let's, let's go ahead and get started on, on, on getting these things uh, connected with some uh, lead free silver solder okay what I typically do first is on this pipe is I'll take a piece of um, steel wool and I'll clean and deburr the inside and it also actually scratches the out outer surface so um, so I can get some good adhesion when I go to solder this 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 uh, piece to the uh, ferrule to the brass ferrule so I just do that a couple times and I and I clean that up I also come to this ferrule here and I also um, do the same thing it doesn't have to be a lot just I just like to scuff it up a little bit and then um, take care of take care of both pieces here like this okay um, so when, when you go to fasten these these, uh, these pieces together, you need to make sure that you flux both sides of these components. I, when I say both sides, I mean the inside of this, and, and use a liberal amount to, to make sure that you cover these sections very well. Uh, you got the one, you got the second one, and then I'll come over here with the pipe and I'll add it around the perimeter of this pipe. And it's crucial for, like I said, it's very crucial that you that you get a good amount of flux on this thing, so you get some good adhesion with that with that silver solder. Okay, so now now I've got those uh, fluxed in. I'll go ahead and set that one on there like that. And I'll set this one on here like this, and I'll twist it to make sure it's se seated right or seated properly, and make sure it's done right like that. Okay, now I'll come in here and I'll put my glove on. Okay, to get. Uh, get my solder and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, solder the one side so you can see what's going on and then I'm going to go ahead and shut her down and then solder the other side so you don't have to watch me do the other side but uh, just to give you an idea on how I do these body sections so uh, so bear with me and I'll, and I'll show you how I do that. You always want to heat, heat the bottom of that uh, brass first before you heat the top of this copper. You, you want the brass hot because what will happen is, is, is this uh, this uh, cop, the solder will, will pull, and pull itself into the back section there, okay? So just, just keep that up real good. See how that kind of drops inside there. See how that can drop inside there like that? Okay, and I'll just work it around. Draw it inside there. Buildup I got in here, okay, and I just take, I just basically take, take my, uh, my brush and just work myself around it, just take all this excess off of here, and get that shoulder nice and square there, okay, and then I'll look inside and make sure I don't have any, any, uh, over, over just coming out of the bottom of that too. basically how I, I add my solder to that joint. Now, you look at that shoulder there, see how tight that shoulder is? It's nice and square. That's what you want, okay? So, um, go ahead and um, 
give, give me a minute. I'm going to go ahead and do the other side, and then um, I'll, sh I'll, I'll, I'll pull you up on another video and show you how that thing looks complete, and then uh, we'll move to the next next portion of, of the body section, and I'll show you what I do after I get this thing taken, taken out. Again, uh, check out my website at rwdistilling.com. Thanks for watching.